Right, so we're back in GTA. We're going to play a few of the story missions because I haven't got that much time. It'll be pretty short, but, you know, the other one was like two and a half hours long, which is probably far too long, so, you know. I guess I'll uh, find a nice medium between those two, if I can. It's obviously, I can. It's just a matter of actually doing it. There we go. We're going to do a mission or two here. Because I've got about 15, 20 minutes to spare. That's it. There's a problem in my goddamn recordings. I don't know why it wasn't saving the file. Nonsense. So, yeah. You say when you are I'm going to go up to a Tony mission, I think. Tony. Get up this fucking hell, this piece of shit car. Fucking shitty old station wagon. And here we are. Here we go. Blowfish. Oh wait. Okay, I've had enough of this shit. We're gonna finish the trial of the Liberty once and for all. Eight balls rigged a dust cart with a bomb. It's on a timer. So if you mess up, there'll be no evidence. Go and pick up the dust cart. Careful. Eight ball says it's real sensitive, and the slightest bump could set that thing off. Their fish factory will open its gates for a dust cart. So you can drive right in, park up between the gas canisters, and get the hell out of there. I want it to rain mackerel. We're talking real biblical here. Nothing low budget. Right, so I think uh, in the previous Let's Play I might have suggested that the, the the clever title for the mission might have been called Blowfish, and that's when I thought I was actually blowing up the, the actual factory. And it is actually called Blowfish, and that mission was not where I was blowing up the factory, because this one is. So, clearly I was just remembering it. I wasn't having a genius idea where I was actually naming the mission more appropriately than the actual developers. Typical. But it's weird, it's obviously it's a cool name stuff for me. I love these cars as well, the Mafia cars, the Sentinels. Fucking cool. Trash Master, it handles like a piece of shit. I didn't get a right, let's do it. I didn't get a pat on the back my Try to blow something up other than myself. After years of fighting in the trenches, Go on. Go on. Hey. Can you tell me what this Australian-American war was? I mean, I really never heard of it. I love that shit. The Australian-American war. It's absolute nonsense. The Australian-American war was the biggest war since the big... I tell you, I did two tours. I love it. I love Chatterbox. It's just so fun. So I can come back here and have a bunch of hits deny history. Oh, shit. Save wire kangaroos with a twerk. Come hopping in. There we go. Well, thanks for the history lesson. Uh, let's go over here. Hello, There's a little burp. I'm not sure if that was picked up or not. Yes, it is. Who's this? My name ain't important. My name ain't important. Uh, no, not really. I mean, this is a radio show. People usually tell us their name. Man, this is fucking... It's so slow. It's like the slowest fucking thing you can drive in this game. It has to be. Even the tank might be heavier, but you can turn the fucking nozzle around. Nozzle. The turret around, and you can shoot. It, like, speeds you up, like, tenfold. It's awesome. It's like a fun way to do the vigilante missions, actually, is just to get the tank and just start blowing the things behind you and just ram into anything that's in front of you. Fucking so cool. If you swear again, we're gonna have to cut you off. This is a family show. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Alright, nearly there now. Get around this corner and then head in through the entrance. I do a man's job at home. She treats me like a little. Here we go. All I get is your power this and your power. Shit, man. Tony, and it's driving me freaking nuts. There we go, there we go. Well, Tony, Tony, imagine all my name was Tony. You're tracing this call. Drive in here ever so slowly. Really intimately acquainted with what your brains look like. My name is Tony. Park this bad boy. But my mom, she keeps going. Don't in between the gas cans. Man, stand up for yourself. Don't take no shit. But all I do is to be a good son, and I want her to show it. Run away! <gasps> Fuck. I kind of was hoping they'd all die. Oh well, I did it myself. Bada boom! Fun mission. 
A new friend for everyone. Yeah, ooh, they handled pretty swiftly. Yeah, I suppose it was riding a trash master. Fancy little fellow, because he's got piece of shit. Pogo the monkey, the best new video game for the whole family. All right, get back here and save. Let's do that Sal mission. Help Pogo escape from the evil research laboratory where the mean old scientist. Pogo the monkey sounds like a game I play. Uh oh, the pharmaceutical scientist is going to get you, Pogo. Here you go, Pogo. Have a gold coin. Good thing Pogo has a banana cannon. Fucking ace skill drive, and you see that shit. Now get the shampoo. Major League Gamer stuff. Yeah, you know, you're impressed. Here you go, Pogo. Have a diamond. You'll guide Pogo through tons of fun Ooh. adventures, including saving Timmy, who fell down. Not a bad fucking truck. Apparently, I have a massive hoodie. Small. Yeah, I heard. I heard what I want to hear. It's fine. <laughs> right, so I kind of fucked up there, so I had to reload this. And we're gonna go do the Sal mission because we just did the uh, blowfish. Where the fuck are the cars? Ah, no. Okay. Right, well. Fuck. Get the, get the fuck out of the car. What you doing? <laughs> oh, that sounded like a wet one. Whew. So my girlfriend just informed me that um, her work has a, a vomiting bug going around. A lot of people are out. And that her brother has now got a vomiting bug. bug. She lives in her place, obviously, not in mine. And uh, she's just basically telling me that there is some kind of way that I'm going to get sick. Definitely. I mean, it's just a given. My immune system is fucking awful. But not awful. It's just my tummy is a bit. Like, I mean, we, we had food one time in a very nice place in Dublin. And um, food was a bit rich. And she was fine. And like two hours, three, two, three, two, maybe, maybe I'd say it's probably more than that. I'd say it was about five hours later. I was. I was in bits. It was just too rich for my tummy. I just, I just couldn't, Leave couldn't handle it. See, so yeah, that's the difference between me and her. The She's just walking past me right now. She's upstairs sharing. Liberty, but we don't know where. Like I get to record this. And they seem to know everything we're doing before yeah. we do. We got us a rat. There's a guy named Curly Bob works the bar at Luigi's. He's been throwing more money around than he's earning. He ain't pimping or pushing, so he must be talking. He usually gets a taxi home after work, so follow him. And if he's ratting us out, kill him. All right, let's do it. I did this a minute ago, and I literally just fucking went to the club and didn't know what I was doing, and I uh, lost him straight away. The taxi, so that was, that was it. And now we are going. Whoop. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Going down to Luigi's again, let's take it out. <clears throat> Wait for this dude to appear and then follow him as best we can. There's a spooko meter, which is just ridiculous. Uh, yeah. So you gotta keep it in the right distance for missions. These are like these are like some of the shittiest missions in this game. Take it away and bring it back again, Mr. Scientist! Yeah. Watch the tone, Trick. Come on. Here we go now. You gotta wait. 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 Come on. Put away the weapons and turn up the bass. There he is. One old tree. Drawn some flashback. Petsovernight.com, and we'll send you a cute kitten overnight. Pets overnight. So he's not really impossible to lose because he's got a giant blue marker floating over his head. So this mission is just slow and boring. Come on. Thank you. Oh. Oh, too close to the dude now. See this shit? Spook gummy are filling up. Just 
just gotta follow this dickhead. He goes to like a, a dock or something, isn't it? And he's like talking to the cartel that are in the second island, maybe? I think that's how this mission goes. And then you gotta go blow up the. blow it up. Spoilers. Spoilers for the game that's been out for 15 years or so. Blow the fuck up out of this tanker. It's pretty badass though. Oh my god, hurry up, traffic. Oh, he's very scared. He's very scared. Didn't even notice, wasn't paying attention. Should have been paying attention. So incognito, like, who would, who would notice this thing following them? Fucking muscle car with flames and shit all over it. Mr. Big Mouth himself. Were you followed? You know what goes on here is our little secret, Amit. No, no, I, I wasn't followed. You got my stuff? Here's your spank, squealer. Now talk. Okay, so the Leones are fighting wars on two fronts. They're in a turf war with the triads, with no sign of either side giving up. Meanwhile, Joey Leone has stirred up some bad blood with the Forellis. Every day they're losing men and influence in the city. Salvatore's become a dangerous and paranoid. He expects everybody and everything. And with loyalty like yours, what has he possibly got to worry about? Now we're gonna kill the rat. Curly Bob, what a fucking name, dude. I'm surprised you lasted this long. Boom, motherfucker. I'm gonna take your gun. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Right. back and save and then we will do another mission. I think we've time for at least one. One more. Let's see now. Ooh shit. Imagine that time. Ah! This motherfucker is hard to control. Holy shit. Alright, there we go. Get into this gaff. Save. In you go. Boom. Saved. Right, let's head up to Salvatore and see if we Come on, motherfucker, drive. Faster, please. Swing through here. Half fun height. Oops. So, Force Awakens comes out. It's probably gonna take this video, but no one watches anyway, so who cares? The Force Awakens is coming out. In. I don't know how many days. I don't even know how many days. So, on Thursday night, as in like Wednesday night going into Thursday morning. So it's Thursday morning, Darren. We have tickets to see it, me and Man, I cannot wait. All the hype. And we're gonna watch Return of the Jedi as the last one tonight. Because we are doing uh, the Machete Order, which means we could have Phantom Menace and just basically watch the other ones. The good ones. The cartel has got the good ones. And the good ones. That spank crap. If we make an open attack on them, they'll wipe the floor with us. They must be making spank on that big boat that Curly led you to. So we gotta use our heads. Or rather, one head. Your head. I'm asking you to destroy that spank factory as a personal favor to me, Salvatore Leone. If you do this for me, you will be a made man. Anything you want. Go and see 8-Ball. You'll need his expertise to blow up that boat. This is like the only time you really see 8-Ball in this game. And because I'm lazy, I'm gonna take a shortcut. This takes reality TV to a whole new level. There we go. Oops, the daisy. That's right, I'm a grown man who says it's the daisy. And let them hunt each other down. It's the reality show. Hey, Paul. 
Where you at? Bond the base act two. Yo, my man. Salvatore phoned ahead, but a job like this is gonna need a lot of fireworks. I'll need $100,000 to cover expenses. But you know with me, you get a lot of bang for your buck. Come back, brother, when you have the money. So that's nothing to us. We did some missions, we did taxi fares, we did all those. Look at what we're sitting on. 100,000. Hundy Tao, we drop Hundy Tao just because we can. That's right, let's do it. Okay, let's do this thing. I can set this baby to detonate, but I still can't use a piece with these hands. Here, this rifle shall help you pop some heads. So I assume you're probably going to see me fail pretty awfully with this because it is all inverted shit and I'm not good with that. I'll never. We'll persevere. Get in the car. Natural selection has Get in the fucking car. Sponsored by ammunition. Remember to put litter in its place. Thank you. So I was just talking about how um how we're watching Machete Order, uh, Star Wars movies, and it's good. It just cuts out. No, that is, it cuts out Phantom Menace and basically watches um the other ones. So you start with uh, five and no four and five. You then watch two and three, and then you watch six. So we're in the middle of doing it. So we've got. Return to Jedi to watch, which is number six, obviously. And it, used be, it used to be my favorite movie as a kid, just because I got to see like Luke, Luke and uh, Darth fight with like proper lightsabers, and he was a Jedi. But Empire since has become my favorite. I think that I love Empire. It's just everything about it is perfect. It's a little nerdy as shit though, but whatever. Look what I'm doing. It, it doesn't get much. Better. And because of the Force Awakens coming out pretty soon, there's so many trailers dropping. We just had like X Men today, I think. X Men Apocalypse. Which I'm actually looking forward to. Brian Singer does an amazing job of directing. Cool, cool, cool. Fucking cast, considering what kind of movie it is. Come with me if you have fucking. I'll head in when you fire the first shot. Michael Fassbender, James McAvoy, quality actors. Jennifer Lawrence, you know, hot as hell. Oh. So yeah, it's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna see all these trailers beforehand. A big massive blowout. Enjoy the movie. Better be fucking good, I tell you that. JJ Abrams, I trust that. Did a good job with Star Trek movies. Never a Star Trek fan, but my god, was Right, so let's do this. Enough talking shite. I wanna go up onto the roof and then start sniping. That's the idea of this mission. Here we go. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ready, come on, hurry up. Hurry up. Fucker still doesn't know what's going on. Unreal. What? How did Ace Ball get it? What? The fuck did he die? Oh, that's just a fucking cunt. Ah. Oh. Well, I'm just, I'm just kind of devastated at that. Fuck. Yet endlessly corrupting. I'm so annoyed. So annoyed. Read my weekly memoirs, entertain more, in the Liberty Tree will understand how important this next movement is to me. Morgan Merriman. Right, I'm gonna go save. Just so I can actually like reload if this ever happens again instead of having to drive the whole way back. That's what you get when you suck at video games, man. You know? 
Now or never. Let's go, let's do this. Let's get it done. I'm filming against the clock now. She's up there, she's showered, she's ready to now, she's gonna do her hair, we're gonna have to go fucking places. You know how it is. Alright. Let's fucking actually try passing this time. That's not really a question. The questions you start. Oh my god. How and why and and they end with your voice going up like this. Sounds like a real monkey and for kids. All right, so we're here again. I might have fucked up, and I'm doing it for a third fucking time. Get a good vantage point, then I'll head in when you fire the first shot. As soon as you wait through another nine minutes of messages from our spot. So yeah, that thing. That's the thing that happened. That 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 just fucking happened. You know? Yep. Fucking genius. Right, so. Let's do this. Get up here. Pop some heads. Just get on with it. Fucking hope. I think I missed some fuckers last time, and that's how I lost. Right, this dude, he's gonna go pop first. Bam. Bam. Right, let me see. This dude. Bam, he's dead. He's fucking dead. He's fucking dead. He's dead. He's dead. Ah, uh, fuck. He's dead. He's dead. Ah, uh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Is there anyone fucking else? Please say that's it. I don't have to fucking do this again. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? Yeah, fucking hell. Three times. I think you could have given yourself a bigger fuse there, dickhead. Oh, damn, that's frustrating. Yeah, that was so satisfying. Tanker's gone. Right, I'm gonna save. Oh, that one reminds me of end this shit. Ah! You can see why I drove into the fucking lake a few minutes ago. Spark gone out of your love life. Looking to add a little adventure to the monotony of the avenue. Hello. Dun 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 dun. Fuck out of my way. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Tonight, the TV event that will like his Liberty City Survivor. This takes reality TV to a whole new level. We'll take 20 recently paroled guys. Boom. That's ending that, so. Right, so, might have said we were done, we're not. Decided I was going to add on to it. It was a uh, bit of a short video after the edits, so we're still going with the second playthrough, I guess. I guess we'll finish off the first island. There's only like one or two more missions left. There's like the betrayal and whatnot, so we'll see. Let's get me a car. Get this bad boy here. Otherwise, we're going to get fucking Echo.
And it guys, we're gonna get fucking echo. And the car got stolen from me. Take your wife to prize, guys. That's what happens. What are you gonna do? Yeah, where are you? Come here. That's a cop car. Of course, the fucking cop car. Fuck them. Very easy way of stealing a cop car right there. They're not the brightest. Not the brightest at all. Oh, shut up. Right, so we'll just head up this way. And we'll meet with Sal, see what he wants us to do. Pretty sure it's like the last mission or the second last mission. It's something to do with your wand. What's this? Okay, right. Paid for it. New and used. Emergency vehicles. Bring them to the frame in the northeast of Portland Harbor. Didn't even know that was a thing. Must have forgot about that. There you go. Can't, can't be expected to remember everything. Let's see what's up once. Last requests. It's my favorite cleaner. I'm proud of you, my boy. You kicked the shit out of those grease balls. I just got one little job for you before we can all celebrate. There's a car around the block from Luigi's Club. The inside is covered in brains. We gotta help some guy make up his mind and it proved a little uh, messy. Take it to the crusher before the cops find it. So I don't fully remember this, if I'm honest. I have a feeling I'm getting set up or something. Something to do with the Forelli brothers that are after Joey. I mean, it has been about 15 years since I fucking played this properly, like story wise. Not 100%, but I have a feeling that it's happening. And then I think I get my own back with Sal, I can't remember how. Maria helps me somehow. Ah, fuck it, we'll just play it, we'll find out. I don't know why I'm bothering to talk about this shit. But it's interesting, I'm still enjoying this game so much. Like the nostalgia of rose tinted goggles that I have on, are, they're working for me. This is Maria. The car's a trap. Meet me at the... Slip south of... Callahan Bridge. Right, so this is how this works out. So you head up here instead of going to get shot the shit out of or blown up. Can't remember what it is. And that was a bit annoying. Whoop! In we go. In we go. There we go. And then we go to the second island, right? And Salvatore thinks that we're going behind his back, so he was offering you to the cartel in order to make a deal. I couldn't let him do that. I mean, the worst thing is, it's all my fault because I told him we were an item. And don't ask me why. I don't know. Look, you're a marked man on the Mafia turf, and I've got to get out of here, too. I've seen too much killing, too much blood. I... Look, this is a friend of mine, okay? She's an old friend. It's, it's just so good. She's someone we can trust. Come on, enough of the speeches. We better get out of here before we get more hysterical Italians wanting less friendly reunions. It just be crazy. Always landing in some manner of crap, huh? Huh? Where's the girlfriend when you need her? Let's get across here, and then I think that this is like the end of the mission. I think we just like chat about how things are gonna go and whatnot. Also, the boats in this game suck balls. Suck. The fact that you can't swim, the fact that you're surrounded by a liquid death, just pisses me off even more so. Probably gonna see me try to dock this for about a half an hour and it's not gonna work. Yep. There it is there. Is it this side or the other side? Ah, it's fucking this side. There we go. Got it. Yep. Missed it. Fucking hate the boats. And you get this stupid welcome to Staunton Island shite. Staunton. Staunton down. Staunton Island. There you go. There you go. There you go. See, I use my noodle. Back it up instead. Back it up, back it up. This is probably the best island, I think. Big, you got fast cars. I'll shut up now. So 
cruise around. You'll need a place to lie low. There's a warehouse at the edge of Belleville that should suit your needs. Come back here to my condo when you're ready, and you and me can have a little chat. So there's some weird vibey shit going on there. Oh, Mark Man, there we go. Boop, boom, trophy. Happy days, and I got 20k for no reason. <laughs> I love this stinger. This stinger is awesome. Yeah. News just in from the traffic desk. Repairs to the Callahan Bridge have been completed. Since the explosion, engineers have been working around the clock to get traffic flowing between Portland and Staunton Island once again. So that's cool. It gives you like a little radio. I always thought it was nifty. Little fuck. I don't know why I said nifty. I'm not from the 70s, but that is a really cool thing. It kind of just gives you a little radio update on what's happening with the with the uh, bridges and whether it's closed and whether it's opening now. It's, it's cool. I mean, look, Jeff. I, I admire your passion. Really, I do. But All right, so it's going to save. Well, I'll tell you what. I might as well put the car in the garage. Have something there for myself. I think, like, I vaguely remember being able to fit like five cars in this garage as well. Like, like you can just like, put as many in as you need. It's cool. And they all heal. Every single one of them. As soon as you put them in. Save game. Bomb the base. You sure? I'm sure. But now you basically cannot go back to the first island without getting this shit shot out of you, which is kind of fucking frustrating, you know? Oh, Nabs. We're here now. We're here now! Let's go check out the old gun store. Say what? The ammunition. See if I can't get anything out of it. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Damn, motherfucker. Stop when I say come here. Oh, come on. No need. No need. Not cool. I knew it knew. Damn it. Right. I think I vaguely remember where I'm going. It's around here and then to the right. Check out what goodies I got in stock for me. Probably nothing. I think you guys unlock them as the game goes, but hopefully something I can use. Something I can buy. Up the fucking arsenal and whatnot. Yeah. Let's see. You want a license? Yeah, you can. Brilliant. Right, so. Buy some of that. Buy some of those. Buy some armor. Buy that. And what is that? Yeah, the AK. I bought the AK. That's fine. Man. Happy days. Come on. Macaw. Shut the fuck up and get out. The Yardies, man. Yeah. How'd you do it again? Yeah, look at that shit. It's awesome. Lowriders, baby. With like fucking. I don't know what you call Hydraulics. Is that it? I'm not a car kind of guy. It was badass. Look at that. Woo! Handles like a piece of shit though. Pretty fucking cool though. It's a really, really cool car. I saved this motherfucker too, so I have two cars if ever I need them. Bash the fuck out of it, don't matter. That's in you. Into an elevator that you never leave from, as you can see through the doors. And save. Cool. Alright, so before I do any more, I think I'm gonna leave it at that. That should be enough. An extra 10 minutes worth of content. Shoot mission. You just see what happens. Sal, probably pissed, gonna kill us now. Whatever, you'll have to stay tuned to find out, or else, you know, play the game yourself, which I recommend. Now, I guys, see it.